Hey everybody, Kyle Mesker here. Uh, cleaned out the garage after Logan Martin. It was so disasterful that I'm not gonna lie, I haven't been back in the boat much. I threw my stuff in here for a local tournament and I have not cleaned out all my just disaster. Um, so cleaning it out, I just wanted to give you a quick review. You know, I, I came into it thinking it was gonna be a drop shot and a, um, you know, little minnow, little FFS action for you. Uh, I couldn't make it fully work, but I did get a few good bites on it, and everybody else did. That's just how every tournament goes. Uh, but swim bait, swim bait game really came in clutch this time. I want to show you what I was using. So from uh, Wise Guys Tackle, we got the 3.3 inch Underboss. This is a great little color. This one is the Blue Gizzard Shad. I put that on a Picasso Lures tungsten ball head with their double titanium weed guards you can see a little blue glimmer in there man you smoke that thing past docks and it was it's about every dock you're getting a bite i mean some of them were crappie if you're crappie fishing that thing is going to be whew, lights out big crappie um but that underboss has saved me the last two tournaments throwing it just winding in old school um chunking and winding a swim bait the other good thing too on that on that tungsten ball hit is if I did pan out from the dock a little bit or, or the structure and I did see one out there, I could drop that down there. That tungsten, uh, if you're a forward facing person and you're not seeing the difference between a tungsten and a lead head, you might need to upgrade, upgrade your stuff because that tungsten comes through so much clearer on your forward facing. Um, I got my Lowrance up there. It makes night and day difference in my opinion. So that's pretty cool. You can throw it out there. I would just drop it down to them and get bites that way or just reel it past the dock. So I was doing a double whammy. You've heard me say it before. This is my forward facing bait. It's Picasso speed drop head. Again, on a mafia minnow. That color is moonstone. Uh, I'll tell you this. I'm noticing, and you'll see that one's a little bit bigger. That's the full size. Usually I bite it down a little bit, but I'm starting to notice that this isn't as much of a finesse game as we're thinking. Um, I'm seeing some bigger baits out there. My, my other favorite color is the uh, gold digger in that. It's got a little gold on the back, a lot of silver flash, white undertones. That clear water down by the dam, I was using mo Moonstone. It's just a little bit clear body. Cool thing is you can see those double hook keepers in there. So that thing's not coming off on every single cast like a lot of other baits. I've tried a lot of other little baits. Um, it's got a super fast fall, which some people don't like. I do like that fast fall. It gets down to them. It gets the job done. Boom, on to the next fish. I haven't noticed the head color matters too much. I don't get into the techni technical decals too much. Um, but that body size being super thin. And what's cool, too, is when you leave it a little bit longer, when you're reeling it through the water, that thing's just looks like a real minnow trying to get away. That tail's just getting it back and forth. So shaking the phone there. I was getting so excited. But um, give those a check out from Wise Guys. Really, uh, your standard swim bait, that was 3.3. They make them a couple different sizes, 2.8. Um, but that's been a killer this year. And then for just a, a affordable, some companies are getting crazy with the price on these forward-facing minnows. Guys, a little piece of rubber. Why are you guys tackles keeping that price down? Check them out, Mafia Minnows. You can bite them down. You can pick your size, you know. Um, Gold Digger, Moonstone, that's my two colors. Picasso Lure, Speed Drop. Absolutely go tungsten when we're talking about forward face and sonar. So that's my little tip on the board face and sonar. Love it, hate it, whatever. Grab you some wise guys tackle and uh, let me know what you think. All right, guys. Next tournament. Bye.